Muscular tissue. Muscular tissue is one of the types of animal tissues. It is also called as muscular fibers because it mainly consists of elongated cells. Muscular tissue is responsible for movement in our body. Muscles contain special proteins called contractile proteins, which contract and relax to cause movement. As seen earlier, muscular tissue is classified as voluntary and involuntary. Involuntary muscles are further classified as smooth muscles and cardiac muscles. Voluntary muscles are those which can be moved by conscious will. These are also called as skeletal muscles as they are mostly attached to bones. They are also called striated muscles because under a microscope they show alternate light and dark bands. The cells of this tissue are long, cylindrical, unbranched or multinucleate meaning having many nuclei. Voluntary muscles help in body movement and are found attached to bones. Muscles and limbs are voluntary muscles. Involuntary muscles are those which cannot be moved by conscious will. Smooth muscles are of this category. They are also called unstriated muscles. The cells are spindle shaped, that is, long with pointed ends and uninucleate, meaning having one nucleus. Smooth muscles help in involuntary movements and are found in elementary canals for movement of food, iris of the eye, uterus, and the bronchi of lungs. The muscles of the heart are also involuntary because we do not have conscious control over it. They have cells which are a bit different from smooth muscles. The cells of cardiac muscles are cylindrical, branched, and uninucleate. Cardiac muscles assist in rhythmic movements and are found in muscles of the heart.